Hi everyone, I'm Olga. Welcome to my channel. Uh, finally, I'm back and I'm sorry uh, because there were no videos on my channel for more than one month. Uh, in January I was quite busy and I had a small trip to Singapore and then Cambodia. And then in February I got very sick and couldn't record any videos. Actually I couldn't speak. I had some problem with my, with my voice. But uh, hopefully now everything is alright and I will continue as before. Um, there are not uh, too many uh, completed pages for these two months but still there is something uh, to show you and I will start from uh, pages that I colored in January so there will be some uh, Christmassy mood still <laughs> and the first page is from Color the World coloring book and I did this page Mm, originally this illustri illustration shows intricately woven baskets but uh, I was still in Christmasy mood and I decided to do something like I don't know Christmas decorations or something uh, like this um, I used Jota Turbo Glitter pens hopefully you can see some sparkle uh, they are nice, but they go, they bleed through very, very much. So you can't use them like in every coloring book, only um, in the ones that one sided. Um, took me quite a while to complete all this, but yeah, it's very joyful. Uh, then the next picture that they completed in January is from Seasons by Hannah Carlson. And here I did one picture. This, um, I call him Polar Cat. I used um, uh, Prisma, Prisma colors and then some Aku Marcus from Aliexpress and white gel pen, that's all. Unusual cat, <laughs> but I imagine him like this, like all in bright colors. Uh, then just after Christmas I received this book, The Beauty of Horror, Ghost of Christmas by Alan Robert. And though Christmas was over, but still I wanted at least to start coloring in this book. And I did two simple pages, like title page and um, page with the name. Here I used my new Arteza real brush pens, I wanted to try them out. Also some budget pencils, nothing special, like a little bit of a glitter pen. You can see here and there, as well as on this page, like stars and some glittery paper on the gifts. Yeah. And now these works are from February. And the first illustration is from Mythomorphia by Kelberosanes. And I did a double spread in this book. Such illustra illustrations always take ages to finish, especially when you use uh, pencils. And on the dragon itself I tried um, for the first time uh, Faber Castel, Castel Polychromos. I got them as my Christmas gift, so I wanted to start coloring with them. 
but all the rest, the small details are used prisma color, a little bit of aqua markers, and the background I did with uh, acrylic paint. And um, here and there, for some small details on the dragon, I used uh, Sakura uh, Stardust glitter pens. Uh, you can see uh, I didn't use um, stickles because um, I thought um, it will affect my coloring on the other page if I use them. So instead, I used um, uh, this Sakura Stardust and also on his nails, you can see, and here on this. I don't know this thing. I find this uh, Sakura Stardust glitter uh, the most glittery from all the other glittering stuff that I have. I, I like really like these pens and they don't bleed through, which is a big plus. Uh, then I got sick and couldn't color a lot and just use simple pictures just to do at least something. And here I use like markers and aqu aqua markers. And on this page I used uh, metal pen, metallic. simple illustrations but they took time uh, the next page is from my very new coloring book this one I bought in Singapore uh, and I thought um, why not to have some simple illustrations book because when you are not into coloring something um, complicated and you want, you want something uh, simple but you get tired of coloring uh, patterns then this book would be very good because illustrations are very simple but uh, they're quite cool and uh, funny and interesting this is Circus by Sarah Walsh and I did this illustration uh, very simple but cute and uh, lovely I think here I used um, aqua markers and some glitter pen and some budget pencils for shading yeah. and all illustrations are in this style a bit childish but but lovely and the last book with completed page is from this Chinese um, coloring book. Uh, this book is dedicated to Chinese opera. And I did this picture, this uh, character from Chinese mythology. It's like um, flying, um, flying monkey or king monkey, I'm not sure. And I have a book about Chinese opera and I saw the character in the book and in the dress is in these colors so I followed like it's supposed to be. Uh, here I use Arteza real brush pens and um, acrylic paint for the background and a little bit of pencils for shading. And that was it, all my works for two months. Um, that's all for today, thank you for watching and bye!